Welcome to SS Live. Thank you for being here. You're probably wondering, how does it actually work? I need to see it in person before I can commit to it. Fair enough. I'm the same with any online product that I'm going to invest a subscription into. Without further ado, you sign up. You click this button, you go through the thing, and then you go to the app once you've done that. Once you've gone to the app, you'll see this window right here. I'm gonna make myself smaller. And this is your window. So, you create a new project, you click this, and then you'll get this window. We're going to use our good friends Athletic Institute, which is the gym that I go to. Here is something that you should have a look into and suss out to see the accuracy. And I'm just going to put in their website here. You can put in whatever you want, the name of it. I'm just going to do that there. I'm creating content for someone else and I want quick ideas that can be created today. If you're creating content for yourself on behalf of the brand, you can select that, tinker, whichever one you want. I'm gonna go with this today, create. And then all of a sudden you have your modules set up for you. You've got pillars, memes, ideas, extended ideas, hooks, and then the script. We're gonna start with pillars because we need the AI to know what the brand is all about. So we get started at pillars. You have the option of putting in the URL of the brand, whether it's your brand or your client's brand or whoever you're collaborating with. Or if you don't have a website, write out as much detail as you can in the description. We're gonna go with URL, I'm gonna paste the Athletic Institute website in there and then we're gonna generate. What you will notice is there's a little robot. <laughs> it is finding all the information, stalking the website, looking through Google, looking for authenticity and all the things that marketers do. And uh, you've got some tips down here on how to create some content. So the pillars pop up immediately and you have six of them. What problem you're solving, here we go, accurate. Why you wanna solve it, accurate. Who you wanna solve it for, accurate. And other people that may be interested, may know someone that may be interested, the horizon audience. Then you have a value proposition articulation and then you have solution offering, what they actually do. Very accurate. So now you have been spoiled for choice. Let's start off with what problem you're solving and you wanna communicate that clearly on social media for this brand. We're gonna go with the first one, understanding the unique fitness challenges faced by young athletes. We're gonna start with memes. I'm gonna click the meme module and this is where you get a little window pop up. You can change this however you like. You can put in your own one in. And then you have a drop down menu, different meme styles. And if you're not familiar what a meme is, seven to 15 second video with a relatable caption at the start, followed by the person or the character reenacting that relatable moment. We're gonna go with surprise me mix and we're gonna generate it. More tips on practical things to do with content creation. Not before long, you have the memes pop up and we can go from here. To get started, if you don't wanna script out anything, this is the option for you. Now, again, the idea is understanding the unique fitness challenges faced by young athletes. The caption, me trying to mimic those workout tutorials by fitness gurus. Juxtaposition of a sleek, perfect fitness video with the real world clumsy attempt to follow along. Okay, very true. Me trying to effortlessly switch from cardio to yoga like a pro. When you realize the light jog is actually a marathon in disguise. These are some fitness challenges definitely faced by youth athletes. So when you realize your coach's easy practice is your hardest nightmare. So the point of this is to relate to this idea and you judge for yourself. I reckon it's pretty relatable. A lot of the time it's going to be reading between the lines to talk to the audience and not specifically talk about the product because you're not trying to sell the product, you're trying to relate to the audience, that's what a meme does. And then over here you have meme cultural references if you still don't get it. And then you can regenerate them, fine tune them however you like. 
Now, let's go back to the pillars and create some ideas. A little bit more professional, someone talking in a video describing what Athletic Institute does. So, providing solutions for those seeking advanced exercise physiology expertise. All right, I'm gonna press the video ideas. This menu item pops up. We have a whole bunch of different items you can choose from, but we're going to just go with recommended. And again, you can change these up however you like. Generate. The video ideas. So again, the providing solutions for those seeking advanced exercise physiology expertise. Mindful movement, exercise and mental well-being. Educational content, the link between physical exercise and mental health, offering simple exercise to enhance well-being. And then you have a whole bunch of other things. The science of stretching, low impact exercises for joint health. These ideas unblock your creativity. The point of this is so that you're the expert, you know what you're talking about, but sometimes you need a little bit of prompting. This is what it does. Now let's say you wanna go science of stretching. Let's expand the idea. We're gonna go controversial, this versus that, leveraging fame, storytelling, scare factor. Ooh, scare factor. Let's try that one. Again, you can edit this however you like still. Let's generate. We've expanded. Stretching nightmares, avoiding the boogeyman of bad posture. The stretching dead, reviving your muscles from stiffness. Stretch or suffer, the terrifying truth about muscle rigidity. Rig rigidity. <laughs> no escape, the consequences of skipping stretching. Ooh, I like that one. A video illustrating the scary long-term effects of neglecting to stretch. Again, where have we come from? We've come from this to help young athletes understand why stretching is important. Let's go with that one. We're gonna create a hook for it because the most important part of the video is the first three seconds. All right, we can still edit this if we want to, but we're going to choose a style. Do we make a statement at the start of the video? Do we ask a question or do we make an opinion? We're gonna go with question style and then we're gonna generate. Once the app starts to identify your brand, it starts to give you specific tips about your industry. You're welcome. So now we have the hooks. What are we doing? Scary long-term effects of neglecting to stretch. Is the secret to self-improvement hidden in your stretches? That's a revised hook. The original, who knew stretching could upgrade your life? Ooh, I like that one too. Why do ninjas always stretch? This stealth stretching secret could unlock your agility. Ooh, okay. Pick one. Only athletes stretch, time to rethink your routine. I'm gonna go back to this one. Who knew stretching could upgrade your life? And I'm gonna press use hook. And now we're into the final module, the script module. Again, you can change this however you like. Drop down menu, I want to be the talking head, which is the guru that talks about it. Let's put that in there. We also have the option of narrator storyteller, which is uh, the same thing as a talking head with a little bit more B-roll, a little bit more content in front of it whilst they talk, and then a skip between two people. We're gonna keep the talking head. There's also some advanced options that are in development. Stay tuned for those. And then we also have theme selection. We're gonna make it entertaining and educational. And we're also going to keep it at 60 seconds maximum. And we're gonna generate. Now the script is being built right in front of you. Now that we have the script generated, we have a breakdown. We have the hook, and then we have what could be put in during the video as a suggestion. Now, do not follow this word for word. My recommendation is this gets you 90% of the way there. You are free to edit this however you like. And then you can see up here, you copy this and put it in whichever platform you wanna keep all your notes and scripts. And we formatted it so it's easy to remember and easy to edit. You've got the speaker and what could potentially be happening on the screen, which is perfect for the editors on your team. We go down to the bottom and we've got the call to action if you want one, and then additional production elements suitable for your photographers, videographers, and creative directors. And that's it. That is how we get that one idea perfectly executed from start to finish. Now you can go back to pillars and choose a different approach and start again. You can go to memes and grab all of these or regenerate them. You can go to video ideas 
and choose a different one to use. You can go to extended ideas and choose a different one. Or you can go to hooks and revise the hook or completely redo the script by simply asking it down at the bottom. We'll be having more updates soon, but thank you for subscribing and I hope you enjoy using SS Live for your content, ideas, generation, and brainstorming.